We're ready for math today, math being Monday, April 6th. T today for math, you're going to have your um, test 12. So if you could go ahead and grab it, have it ready. It looks like this, test 12, and it says page 97 and 98. There's a front and a back, so let's be sure we're doing both, okay? Um, normally, when we have our math test, we have a page that we do in class, you know, like a review sheet, and that's page 255 and 256 out of your math book. Just hold on to that. It's plotting points. Um, what I'd like for you today to do today is concentrate on the math, math test, okay? The 255 and 256 hold for a rainy day. When you finish your math test today, please have someone send me a picture of the front and the back so I can grade it. So we can keep up in our grading as we go along. Okay, so let's look at the test 12. I'll go over the instructions for you. Number one, solve the story problem. Carly earns $3.75 per hour helping in her parents' dog grooming business. If she works two hours every Saturday for five Saturdays, how much will she earn? Okay, this is a two-step problem. Um, you got to find out one piece of information before you can answer the question. This uh, number one is four points, so be careful here. Number two, follow the signs. They are, these are three points a piece. Please be careful. Um, make sure that you have your eight and nine table written and you have it where you are can have it handy. Please don't guess, okay? Make sure on E and F, G and H, you're watching the sign there, okay? Um, so just please be sure you're watching the sign. These are not all addition. Please note that. Number three, um, 3A and 3C have remainders, okay? Um, you can, on 3A and C, you can short divide or however you want to do it, but please be careful. These are six points a piece, so you don't want to try to make numbers work. I mean, if it doesn't, if you're checking it and it doesn't work, don't make it work. I'm not looking for the check, I'm looking for all the steps, okay? Number four on the back, please be sure you do the back. Number four, find the fractional part of each whole number. Number five, reduce to the lowest terms. Now you can come under 5a and do the math, what you want, because they don't give you the number to divide by. You have to find, remember the largest number that we see both of these, um, the mo both the numerator and the denominator on, and it divides evenly. All right. So for five twenty-fifths, we would not divide by six because no, that those are not on the six table. Number six, mark the circle under. Oh, I'm sorry. The reduced to the lowest term. Those are three points apiece. Um, number six, mark the circle under the mixed numbers. Only mark the mixed numbers. Those are two points apiece. Number seven, write the Arabic numbers for these Roman numerals. Please, please, please be careful. Remember our strategy here of going above the letters and writing the values where we're isolating, oh, this is a smaller before a larger. Oh, this is, this is something right here. So please be careful with those values, okay? Those are two points a piece. So again, this video is short because you are doing the front and the back of your math test, test 12, okay? Um, have someone send me a picture of both the front and the back for grading. The page in your math book, hold on to it. We're, we're, we're gonna just concentrate on our test today, okay? So once you finish with your test, we will be ready for reading after that, okay?